Hi and welcome to the DE Physical Education Flip Learning Videos. Year 7 Sports Science Components of Fitness Everyone needs to have a level of fitness for everyday activities. Fitness can be split up into 12 different components. They are often referred to as components of skill related fitness and components of health related fitness. Health related fitness. This involves cardiovascular fitness, muscular strength, muscular endurance, flexibility and body composition. These can be defined as cardiovascular fitness, the ability to exercise the entire body for long periods of time, muscular strength, the amount of force a muscle can exert against a resistance, muscular endurance, the ability to use voluntary muscles many times without getting tired, flexibility, the range of movement possible at a joint, body composition, the percentage of body weight that is fat, muscle or bone, cardiovascular fitness, the ability to exercise the entire body for long periods of time. The sports that use this are basketball, football, hockey, netball, dodgeball or other invasion games. You would also find it in long distance events such as swimming, marathons and athletics. Any event that takes longer than 10 seconds will use cardiovascular fitness. Muscular strength. The amount of force a muscle can exert against a resistance. Sports that would use this are rugby, athletics such as throwing, jumping events, weightlifting and the majority of sports will use muscular strength in some form. Muscular endurance. The ability to use voluntary muscles many times without getting tired. For example, long distance events such as swimming, marathons, athletics or triathlons. The majority of sports will use muscular endurance in some form. Flexibility. The range of movement possible at a joint. Sports that will use this are gymnastics, dance, diving and athletics. Body composition. This is the percentage of your body weight that is fat, muscle and bone. The three different types of body are referred to as somatotypes. This then breaks down to ectomorph, endomorph, and mesomorph. Ectomorphs are usually very narrow and skinny. Endomorphs are usually sort of a round shape. And mesomorphs usually have a V shape, so their hips are smaller than their shoulders. Everybody will be a combination of these three.